Hi, welcome into Jatai Academy. I am Ivan Zoot, and this is another video in our continuing series of education and support for beauty and barber professionals. I want to share an idea with you today, a fun idea that I know can build and grow business in the sale of professional take-home hair care product, the single most lucrative category of business, and the single most profitable opportunity in the beauty and barber business, and an area that many beauty and barber professionals don't always reach their potential and hit the incredible profit opportunities that are available to them. So we're going to talk about what's called a PlayStation. Have you heard of a PlayStation? No, I don't mean the one you hook up to your TV to play video games on. I mean a PlayStation where clients can play with their hair, sometimes referred to as a finishing station. Now, back when I had my salon, I was a hair cutter and I cut a lot of hair but I didn't style a lot of hair. My salon was a low priced high volume, family oriented haircutting establishment. We did 330 to 350 haircuts a day. I don't have to tell you with that kind of volume happening in my shop, I did not want to spend a lot of time blow drying people's hair. And my philosophy as a hair cutter was if I cut your hair well, and if I cut your hair right, and if I cut your hair in a manner that it will live up to your expectations, you're going to be styling your hair 30 days of the month. Why today, when I'm cutting your hair, should I style it? If you're going to style it 29 days of the month, you should style it on the day that you have it cut as well. Because if you can work with it, if you can style it, if you can make that hair happen, you're going to love me, you're going to love your hair, and we're both going to be happier. So we use an extra styling station. Tip number one, we've all got a vacant station or an extra station in the corner. If you don't have an extra station, build an extra station in the waiting area. Number two, stock that styling station. Stock it with all of your professional hair care products that are available for purchase. Don't ever put a product on a counter that's not available for purchase at the front of the store. Stock it with blow dryers, curling irons, combs, brushes, clips, all the tools and equipment and accessories that are necessary for styling hair. When you're finished cutting a client's hair, invite them to the PlayStation. Now, some salons offer blow drying built into the haircut and styling built into the haircut. Other salons have that blow dry styling as an a la carte option. In my salon, we had it as an a la carte option, but I didn't want to do it. I wanted you to style your own hair. I would walk you over to the PlayStation. I would select the products that are appropriate for your hairstyle. Use this gel, use this wax, use this hairspray, and I would lay them out in a row on the counter at the front for you to use. I might also recommend a brush if it was appropriate. I'd point out where the blow dryer was. I would share what we had done in the haircut and what that styling objective was. And then, Mr. Productivity, I would go back to my station and what would I do? That's right, I would do another haircut. And what would you do? You'd style your hair at the PlayStation, at the self-serve finishing station. Now, what happens here is a lot of things can happen. Sometimes a client will, hey, Ivan, call my attention and say, my bangs still seem like they're a little too long. No problem, quick fix. Sometimes a client would say, I'm having trouble getting a little bit of lift here or getting it to move over this way. And I'd come over and give you a hand show you a pointer, teach you a styling trick, engage and support your efforts at the PlayStation. Sometimes, and more often than not, in the middle of styling their hair, the, the customer would look at me, grab my attention and say, hey Ivan, do you sell this? And they would hold up the gel they were using or the spray they were trying. This is where the beauty of the PlayStation comes to life. Because in this way, clients are trying, touching, smelling, feeling, exploring, and experiencing the products that you're recommending for them, which as we know in the industry, almost always leads to a successful purchase transaction. Hey Ivan, do you have this? Where can I get this? Oh, we got them right up front for you. No problem. That's the magic and the beauty of a PlayStation allowing clients to play with their hair. A PlayStation, that's like Disneyland for hair people. This is where they go to experience and play with our toys. Little tip, all the products on the station are available for purchase up front. Any of the brushes you have on the PlayStation, order extras, 
brand new boxed and packaged, have them up front for purchase. And have a bin on the counter, in the drawer, on the floor, somewhere near there, where used combs, brushes, clips, any tools or equipment that need to be cleaned and disinfected after they've been used by clients go into the dirty bin. That way we're also reinforcing our connection to and our enthusiasm for sanitation and infection control within the salon environment. That's a PlayStation. If you've experimented with one, I'd love to hear about your successes. If you have questions on how to implement a PlayStation or how to make a PlayStation concept work for you and your business, I am here always ready and available with questions or with answers to questions and with help. JATAI.net on the web is Jatai Academy and Ivanzoot.com is where you will find me. I look forward to hearing from you and I look forward to seeing you again in another video here at Jatai Academy. Thanks for watching and have a great day.